Uh, there are many use cases in blockchain which are uh, multi-party use cases. For example, trade finance, you're dealing with a number of banks, uh, you're dealing with a number of corporates such as exporters, importers, insurance companies, uh, shipping companies, and all of them uh, can be brought together on the blockchain platform. And this will be a big change for them because this world has not seen uh, tech improvement for a number of years. So there will be new business models and which will require new set of regulations. But uh, this is not going to happen in a, uh, in a quarter or a couple of quarters. This is going to uh, go through its process. And I think uh, all of these topics will get resolved in the due course as we make progress. Uh, certainly, if you look at trade finance, that world has not changed for 10 or 15 years. If I compare that with equities, fixed income, that's already uh, gone through STP, the straight through processing. So what uh, the trade finance world needs is a straight through processing. And uh, blockchain is, is, uh, is a great technology to achieve that purpose. So that's why uh, when I see a number of pilots, I, th I see it as a positive sign that many participants are trying to solve this problem from different angles. Uh, some uh, of the pilots are running from the bank's perspective, which is great. Uh, but we also need to have pilots running from the corporate's perspective. Like uh, that is uh, to get their adoption going. I think we need to get the corporates, the shipping companies, the insurance companies on the chain. Because that will complete the ecosystem. And hence, uh, we welcome when we see a news of a new pilot. We actually welcome it because all of this is work in progress, and uh, so, uh, the success uh, will get will get there to a successful stage. All of these are incremental steps. Certainly, I think if you look at the KYC topic, uh, although the industry has gone through an evolution, earlier they, every bank will do KYC, now you have utilities such as KYC and DDCC, Clarion doing the KYC checks. But the problem, the issues from the corporate side is not yet solved. A corporation still has to go to bank one, utility one, then bank three, and another utility to provide KYC data. That's very, very inefficient to say the least. And it also introduces risk. What if you are not getting the most up-to-date information in your KYC? So what we see is a technology like blockchain can allow these uh, corporations to control their data and provide that data to many banks in a permission fa fashion. So they can say, hey, here is my KYC data. I am responsible for maintaining it. I am a corporation. But uh, this can be accessed by bank 1, 5, and 7, and nobody else. So it solves the uh, sharing, data sharing is issue and that, that's what makes it more efficient.